Hey guys and welcome back to a new video on this channel, I'm Sabi from Code Revolution. So because of popular demand, I will be showing you how to decrease API usage on headless browser API when you are using Crawlomatic. So if you are a subscriber to headless browser API and you are using it to scrape JavaScript rendered content from any website in the Crawlomatic plugin, then this video will help you to reduce API call count for it because as uh, you might know your subscription is limited to a number of API calls per month and per day. So if you want to keep yourself inside of these limits then follow the steps shown in this video and you will be able to do so and reduce the usage of API calls that the Crawlomatic plugin will do. Okay, so the first thing is go to Crawlomatic and in the main settings menu search for remember imported links and do not crawl them twice. So this is the main part of this video so you must check this in the Crawlomatic plugin settings and if you check this the Crawlomatic plugin will remember where it was the last time it crawled and will remember all crawled links and it will not crawl links twice. So this will make the usage of the API calls from headless browser API way smaller. So by default the Crawlomatic plugin will uh, scrape and crawl links and it checks their content if, if, and if their content is already posted on your site then it will skip that specific link from posting it again. But if you check this checkbox, this will not happen and the Crawlomatic plugin will remember where it left and which links it scraped and crawled and will not crawl them twice. Also, I recommend that you uncheck the check duplicate post by title instead of source URL checkbox. So this must be unchecked. And this must be checked. So remember important links and do not crawl them twice checked. And check duplicate post by title instead of source URL unchecked. So these tips will help you reduce the API call count for headless browser API. Don't forget to save settings now. Also, if you are using paging for getting content from paged sources, then this checkbox, the remember last page URL checkbox will be very helpful for you to reduce um, API call counts for headless browser API. But this will be useful only if you use the seed page pagination query type settings field to get paginated results from uh, the different pages. So for example, if you have a uh, scraping if you are scraping sites like TechCrunch and you might go to page two of results and get links also from there and go to page three from results and get links also from there you will be able to do this from this settings field and this checkbox will make the plugin remember the last paginated uh, post and the last paginated page where it left so it will continue to run the next uh, run the next time it runs it will continue to run from page 3 of results that you paginate here so this is also useful to reduce call count to the API but keep in mind this is only if you uh, get paginated crawling strings from the seed page here if you don't use this then you don't need to check the remember last page URL. However, keep in mind that the uh, most important uh, tip from this video will be the settings that I showed you. Remember important links and do not crawl them twice. So this is the one that I recommend checking if you are using Headless Browser API and also uncheck the one from above it. Check duplicate post by title instead of URL. So yeah, I hope this info is helpful and you will be able to reduce call count in Headless Browser API if you are struggling with this. And until next time, have a nice day, stay safe, bye bye.